Hello, everyone. My name is Matija Babic. I hope you're all doing well. My partner's name is Rafael Mamadov. You will meet him in just a moment as soon as I am done presenting with my part. Today, we will be sharing our learning experience as we interviewed our prospect. Our prospect, Mr. Sahib Mamadov, is the director of sales for the company Caspi Group. Caspi Group is a business to business seller of promotional products. They sell a variety of products such as pens, keychains, and notebooks, all with company logos and names on them. Caspi Group is, a physically lo- is, is physically located in the country of Azerbaijan and conducts most business locally, but does offer online shipping options to those outside the country. The first thing I would like to share that we learned from doing this project is simply how hard it can be to actually find a prospect. We were surprised, firstly, how hard it was to contact some of these professionals, and secondly, how unwilling some of them were to help us out, and they just didn't seem interested. This simple exercise really opened our eyes and showed us firsthand how to deal with potential prospects. It also showed us how hard obtaining a prospect in the real world can be, and through this we learned the value of prospects and how to treat them right so that both parties can be satisfied at the end. So the second thing we learned as a group from this project is that we cannot take the same approach. We must be adaptable. We have to adapt for our clients. We have to adapt for our prospects. We have to change so that we appeal to them. Just as we learned in class, we got to apply this firsthand when calling potential prospects and asking them to be interviewed. We eventually tried a different approach to our calls, one where we tried to figure out sort of what communication style our potential prospect had, what kind of personality they had at the time, and then we would appeal to that. Of course, we didn't learn all the necessary terms and the communication styles at the time, but we were trying our best. Moving on, my partner Raphael will continue sharing what we learned in this project, and thank you all for listening to me. Hey there, it's Raphael Mamarov. I'll jump right into it. So, um... The third thing that we learned during this interview exercise was to find out that sales can be so different based on uh, based on the industry that we will choose after graduating. Doesn't matter if it's B2B or B2C or different fields of businesses, there's always different techniques that we will have to use during our sales pitches or when we will have to find a prospect. So what we learned is that we always have to um, learn adapt and adjust uh, the way that we try to pitch our customers, our possible clients, prospects. So, you know, as the phrase goes, the more you live, the more you learn, right? Um, Moving on to the next part of the exercise, um, finding out two things that surprised us the most. Um, I would go with... uh, well, the first, the first thing that surprised me the most was finding out that sales department is actually under marketing department. That was really unusual turnout of events for me because my whole life I thought that they're equal departments, but this was a new thing to learn and I'm glad that I learned that. Um, and second thing that surprised me personally the most was... Uh, finding out that there there are people out there who are willing not only to spend their time to give some like 10, 15, 30 minute interview for you, but actually to share the, all of the information that they possess about their industry, just to see someone else succeed and to see them not to go through the same hardships that they went through in the first place when they were starting their their career so this was really unexpected this was really nice and heartwarming in some in some way i'm glad that we did this exercise i'm glad that we found out that there are a lot of people like this um i'm glad that our interview um agreed to this interview that he shared a lot of insights she shared a lot of information with us that we will remember and use in in our future in our future careers uh well well thank you for thank you for listening to us and hope you enjoyed this journey as much as we did 
and all and any feedback we will be waiting for all and any feedback whatsoever thank you very much